having coaching conversations. It might be simple, but it's not easy. You know, and being able to have coaching conversations, uh, have the courage to have that, uh, sometimes can be tough. But what helps is when you're prepared. So I, this is some of the questions I use when I do my leadership trainings. It's a little, what I call a coaching companion. A series of questions. I'm gonna just walk you through it. Number one is what's going on? What's really going on? Oftentimes when you ask the second question, it'll kind of lead you to the actual real answer. What would be your ideal outcome? What are your concerns in attaining that? So what's now possible? And what's the first step? So just kind of a series of questions. So the next time you have to have a coaching conversation, have your questions ahead of time that'll give you the confidence to then actually have those conversations. The management question. Do you want someone to manage you or what you tell them? This is a question that I use in my program, Manage Promises, Not People. And that this is a question that allows for higher levels of responsibility and ownership. Because when you ask this to someone, do you want someone to manage you or what you tell them? Most 90% of folks say, hey, I'll just manage what I tell you. However, with power comes responsibility. And so getting people to take ownership in what they commit to, and then also having the follow-up as well. So the management question, use it in your leadership situations. All the best.